Good morning. Today is Friday, August 26, 2022. It's sunny and my 39 years anniversary. I'm walking around right now. The place where we got our hotel or our small villa. And it's in Sikihor, Philippines. Uh, these are all the cottages or little villas they call here that you could rent um, there's two for two and this one is up on a tree and there's some on near the water the beach and that's their restaurant right there and yesterday there was a wedding but looks like the decorations been pulled down because it rained last night but this is the area. It's a big area. There's a lot of um, small little houses, villas, or whatever, cottage, whatever you want to call it. And I'm heading right now to the beach. And this is the view from where we're staying. We've been here for two nights now. And there's the restaurant, and that's where the wedding party was last uh, yesterday they were there from 2 o'clock until 10 o'clock at night and you could inquire if you want a destination wedding here in the Philippines it's a beautiful area and there's my pare and mare they're taking video of the water there's a lot of dogs look at this I miss my little Shiloh who we lost last February 5 we had him for 13 and a half years so this is the beach where we're staying it's just a walking distance it goes far you could go for a walk and the water is so clear it's just that right now there's a lot of like a parks I think I don't know what you call it but it's natural dirt it's no human dirt here it's look at look at the sky and look at all these coconut trees look how beautiful this resort that we are in right now there is a lot of resort that you could go but this is the Bruce resort and it's called the Bruce, I guess, Beach Resort. And it's affordable. It depends on which room do you want to take. There is air, condition, air conditioner room, which is more, of course. And there's rooms that it's near the beach that doesn't need an air conditioner. They're, they're made out of woods, I think, the, the houses that they built. But the one that we're in, uh, we... They weren't any more available for two nights, so we end up in the little villa we stay, we're staying in right now. And it um, slips four people. Uh, and believe it or not, we came here without a reservation. And we were able to get a, a one room for four of us without reservation and that's why we're here and I just saw this in the internet and before we left we left Sikihor and my husband said don't worry it's weekdays we don't need to make a reservation I'm pretty sure they could accommodate us if not there's plenty of places near the beach that you could rent a room and when we got here, the first thing we stopped by on is the beach, I mean the, the Bruce Hotel. And they were able to accommodate us with one room <coughs> for four people. First thing that they showed us was the one closer to the beach with no air condition, but it, they could only give it to us for one night the only that but they do have that available that we have for four people 
it's a little bit far from the you saw how far it is it's not that far and it's air conditioned so we took that one because like i said even when I saw it in the internet, I already knew this is the hotel that I want to stay in. So I was right. We were very happy. Very clean room, very clean bathroom because that's a very important to me that we have to have a very clean room. I would not settle any otherwise. You know, if you're gonna go on vacation, go for it. And like I said, this place that we are in right now is very, very affordable. If you're look, you know, watching your spending money, and there's a restaurant across from it. It's called Dagsa. Oh, the food is so good. It's um, they even have American food. They we had American breakfast yesterday, and if you want Filipino breakfast, they also have it. And uh, dinner, we ordered two pizza. It's um, very, it's also really good, tasty. And they have this called a salad called dagsa salad. It's with romaine lettuce and has a lot of fruits on it, like um, watermelon, mango, grapes. Um, I don't know what else in there. And it has a mango dressing. It's not sweet. It was very good. It was only for $3.95. So that's less than $10 in our dollars um, in the US. And it's a big size salad. And my husband had a, pa a pasta. And my um, compare bought pancet. So we had American, uh, Italian, and Filipino dinner last night, and we had so much leftover that we could eat the pizza for breakfast. Hey, who likes, who doesn't like cold pizza for breakfast, right? So, yes, yeah, so this place is so quiet, and right now it's about almost 7 o'clock in the morning here, and look how quiet it is, and how beautiful the view so i think you guys gonna love this like i said the name of the hotel is the bruce resort beach resort uh, i don't know if that's the exact name but if you google the bruce you will you will find it look at this it's like you could tell you're in the philippines because it's so quiet and guys just an information for you guys if you go to sikihor it's we were told it's zero crime here so people live here without fences you know and they leave their cars unlocked sometimes i heard and it's so beautiful here look at look at this two uh, villas or bungalow or whatever you want to call them these are the no AC, no air conditioner here because it's by the water. Uh, this one is, um, I guess, it's under renovation. That's their restaurant right there next to it. And like I said earlier, this is where the wedding was last night. So, and straight to this road, you just go straight here and you will see where the reception area is that's where we checked in very nice people um, very accommodating they because we weren't sure which room we want to get so we asked if they could show us the room actually the first room that they showed us that it is um let's see it's not air conditioning is this one is this first this is the first room that they showed us good morning pa good morning. <laughs> we're gonna go by the pool right now so this is where the pool is it's open from 9 to 9 9 a.m 9 p.m so so if you don't want to go right now i guess nobody's um swimming 
in the beach so if you don't you could go here and they have their own swimming pool right like now I think it's locked so we can just go bring it in and just kind of show you around it's kind of big enough you know it's good enough there's only few people you know so still quiet because people are still sleeping so see there's Maria and Shirley taking video too yeah um, so this is the area the Bruce I see how beautiful the rooms are they all look um, nice to me because I'm very happy where I was or I am shall I say I haven't checked out yet but we are ready to check out today we're going back to Dimogede for another three nights at the uh, Essentia Hotel so this that's that's our room the end over there but I'm gonna go around there's a house in the tree there's Paring Alex oh there's a cat sorry cat I'm allergic to you I can't play with you so the main one of the main transportation here is the motorcycle they hardly have any Jeep here so each uh, I was told by our driver Walter the or we were we were told by Walter uh, while he's touring us on the island that uh, each family here own a motorcycle because that's the mean one of their number one means of transportation there is not a lot of public transportation so the there's only total of two jeep for public transportation in the island and they only go I think in the morning and in the afternoon and that's it it's not like in the city that every so, so many so much minutes you you have a bus that you could hop on but here only two uh, jeepneys and that's it there is the reception area in the corner over there that's the reception that's where we checked in there is water like a small waterfall and a small bridge it's nice so this is the front of the hotel they have a small souvenir shop over there where the lady is sweeping and this I get and they have even have a mini minibus the Bruce there's the I guess Bruce we ask who why Bruce the title the name of the thing so it is called the Bruce the luxury private cottage San Juan Sik Sikihor Philippines so there's the guard and this is where the gate is the there's over there is where I told you the Dagsa restaurant it's closed we just ordered it and they delivered it last night but if you want to walk like we went there twice already we ate lunch our first day and the next day we ate breakfast then we did our tour then we came home at night we ordered a pizza like I told you salad and pasta and pancit so we're he I'm heading back to, to our little cottage so it's Martin Shirley going around with me taking our own video of the place and so this is the Bruce so I highly recommend it to everyone who wants to come in Sikihor Philippines it's a very quiet clean very very clean I love the room because like I said I'm very particular my husband knows that that I'm very particular on where we stay that's why we cannot just stay in a, just kind of room settle in no I just don't settle I'm not saying you know I'm not gonna pay a lot of money either but you know for a, a very nice place to stay but we hit the jackpot here
it's affordable. See, here's one. It looks like it sleeps a lot of people. There's four beds in here. There's nobody here right now. So if you have a big family, you could even save here. Look at this. It's a much bigger room than ours. So that's empty. This one is empty. This is one is look like ours. Two beds. And after you went swimming, guess what? You could hang your clothes, your towels in here. There was a table here, or, um, we just brought it inside the room because um, it's too early and sometimes it gets really warm. We like to stay in the air-conditioned room, so we brought it in and that's where they're eating breakfast, uh, Sunny and Compadre were eating breakfast this morning. So everyone, I'm signing off right now. Just letting you know, this is Sikihor, Philippines, and we're at the Bruce Resort. I hope you enjoy my um, tour of this place. And like I said, I highly recommend this place. And if you have, want a destination wedding, this place looks like a great place to have it. Because yesterday, I, um, I forgot to go out at night because I didn't want to bother them. There was a wedding. I didn't want to intrude, but we did take a picture before the wedding when they were getting ready. So anyway, goodbye for now. I hope you enjoyed it. Have a blessed day. Bye.